What's going on guys and welcome back coach Stoneface here and today we have an exciting one I was able to pre-order and get my hands on 2020-2021 Upper Deck Premier Now this is by far the most high-end product I've ever opened in terms of sports cards Previously was this box This New, Year, New Year's Day 2022 break uh, Where it's four premium cards per pack, chronology this is more than double the price. So I am going to actually flip this over. I called my local card store and I'm like, hey, I want to pre-order. Tell me what you what I'm working with. And this is what they told me. My local card store. $639.95 plus tax. So in Canada and Ontario, that is a whopping almost $725. I was able to get this from a not local card store um actually from a a one in the gta um for a lot less for for actually under 500 uh it was for 4.99 so uh i jumped on it i got one i wasn't gonna open this I, i'm not gonna lie i was just gonna try to to just break even and, and get my money back but you know what you only live once so here we go now i've seen about 50 of these open so far it is launch day it is release day uh, i've seen about 50 of them opened and i haven't seen any monster pulls um i have seen a mcdavid auto i have seen a R or not an rpa but a a patch auto of dry i've seen a kaprizov jersey uh, i've seen a stutzla rpa um but nothing huge now i can already tell we have a thin one super super thin so that pretty much guarantees us one patch and only one patch um and yeah so i mean we're, we're guaranteed one rpa two base cards one rookie one uh veteran and then uh three other hits um by the looks of it we are going to get those jersey hits instead of of anything else so um yeah, I'm, I'm quite nervous. You can probably hear it in my voice. You can probably hear it in pretty much everything I'm doing. But I do have a new decoy. We have a Coach Stoneface decoy. So without further ado, let's see what we're able to do. Now, I'm not worried if the first card, because it is just a base card, is showing. Um, now with that being said... It's not a bad base card, but you can see there, wait for it to come into focus. It's not really coming to focus, but it is one patch. So we will go like this. And our first card here is a base card number 55 of 299, Austin Matthews. Now, as a Leafs fan, I'm okay with that. Uh, I mean, the big... The big pull in this is the the mega patches. Really unfortunate that we're gonna miss out on that. But we do have our Austin Matthews. Our second card is our base rookie. And it is of VTech Vanacek. So again, I just get in the base ones here, and this is 53 of 299. I didn't get any gold, so they're not low numbered. I can already I didn't see the name but i can see that i don't think it's a special rpa so we will go for vtech vanacek there now i do want to keep the rpa separate oh, i can see green which can be good if it's kaprizov so we'll put that there all right we'll go next here which is a rookie auto of ty smith so that's pretty cool rookie auto ty smith this one is not numbered but it is, I don't, that's, I don't think that's right. Maybe it is. It looks like just the outline maybe of what's on the front. But Ty Smith, rookie auto. You know, if you want this, you want it to be numbered. That one, unfortunately, is not. Next, we are going to go a Premier Attractions. So just a basic jersey card. 40 of 99 of Elias Pedersen. So hopefully he has a back or bounce back year. 
bottom corner is a little rough on it, but not bad. Not bad. All right. <clears throat> and our last heat one here, we have a Keandre Miller. Again, just rookie Paramount Premier. Just shows his jersey number. These ones are not numbered, so... Um, Unfortunately, we, we have an auto and a jersey card here that is not numbered. We got two base cards that are not numbered. Or sorry, or just your basic numbering. So we need a monster hit to make this anything. So, so we have a rookie auto patch. Number 76 of 249 of oh, Dallas Stars. So, okay, Jason Robertson. Not bad. Not bad. Number 76 of 249. Can't remember what Jason number Jason Robertson is. 21. So, not definitely not jersey numbered. But Jason Robertson, that is a pretty cool patch. You can see it. Uh, you know, you get part of the Dallas logo there with the jersey. Now, it does seem to be crammed in there, but it is a three-color patch of Jason Robertson on card, number 76 of 249. Now, he's having a phenomenal year, don't get me wrong, but he is not one of the big guys. The big three I would say you're looking for are Kaprizov, Lafreniere, and Stutzla. So this one might even be a little bit too big in the case here, but we'll... So there is our Jason Robertson auto. So we did get two autos in this. Obviously the big one being Jason Robertson. Um, we got a Ty Smith rookie auto. We got a Keandre Miller rookie jersey. An Elias Pettersson jersey. And then a Austin Matthews and Vitek Vanacek base cards. So there you go. That is what a box of 2020-2021 Premier looks like. Um nothing too crazy hope you guys enjoyed my coach mystery pack wednesdays that came out today uh, i'll post this one right away but yeah jason robertson rookie patch auto three color cool patch not the name you're looking for but um again two defensemen probably not what you're looking for when they're not kale mccarr or adam fox but um thank you very much for watching hopefully if you have this you had better luck if you did pick up a box of premiere today let me know uh let me know what you what your hits were and if you had a better experience or a worse experience than mine and let me know what you thought about this box um from what i've seen you know what <laughs> jason robertson i can't really be picky about that um i've seen a lot worse out there so let me know what your thoughts are thank you very much for the support don't forget to like comment like i said and subscribe and i will see you guys in the next one